Hello everyone, my name is Chris and this is a new lesson on Learn British English Free on YouTube. We have a modern grammar topic for you today, so it's something you might not have read about before. I need to thank Evgeny in particular in Russia for his suggestion, his idea in making this video. Hello Evgeny, thank you. And also I'd like to say hello to Danny, of course. Um, so this and that is the subject and what am I going to talk about? It means when you're referring to different things in English and the prevalence of that over this. I will explain with examples. Please look in the description for the text or put the captions on and you can read the words that I'm saying on YouTube. This is my pen. We use this because it's here. So this describes something which is here. Uh, I want this pen. I don't want that one. This one here, that one over there. This near, that far. This is the normal thing. However, when we talk about things apart from an object which is very close to us, we always use that nowadays, especially when referring to a subject in conversation that is understood. We can say the basic example, I don't want this one, I want that one over there. But some other examples, Uruguay beat Portugal in the round of 16. Yes, I saw. That was a great performance. It's clear that we're talking about the match, the football match in the World Cup, and the performance of Uruguay. But I still use that. I don't use this. Because we use that to refer to any spoken subject or matter, even if it is the one that is right here, right now. You can also use that for following up on a topic that you introduce, for asking someone's opinion. Another example. The sunny weather is going to continue for another couple of weeks. What do you think about that? I'm asking someone's opinion there with what do you think about that? So I start the topic by talking about the weather, but still I use that even though it seems it should be further away, this is just not natural. We don't use it to describe the topic of conversation. What do you think about that? Even though the subject is so clear, it's right here, we still use that. And uh, a final example, maybe I have a prop to help me. You might have seen it before. I'm going to a party on Friday. Should I wear this hat to the party on Friday? Ooh, I'm not sure about that. Again, using that for the idea, wearing the hat to the party in this case. This or, th uh, this or that, that or this, this and that. Normally you need that, not this. I hope these examples made it a little bit clearer for you. Please write to me if you have any comments about the grammar or about my hat. But the main, th sorry, not, not my hat, my mum's hat. But the main thing is um, that you understand that that is more important than this. I hope that's clear. Okay, thank you again to Evgeny for your suggestion for this video. I hope it was useful for you. And thanks to everyone for watching. You can join me on Facebook on the Learn British English page and the Learn English Free Public group. I tend to make some live lessons there so you can watch those. And we're on um, Twitter, Tumblr. Please subscribe on YouTube, on Instagram and come to the main website www.learnbritishenglish.co.uk. Everything is free and everyone is welcome. I hope to see you soon. Take care for now, good luck with English, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.